Hey everybody, welcome back. We're doing some Magic the Gathering today, uh, March of the Machine. Uh, Pre-release is today, the 14th. Um, if you got a premium store, you can actually get your hands on all of this stuff right now. Um, yeah, brand new set, continuing the story of Phyrexia All Be One. Cool little art in there. I, I don't want to open it because whatever. Anyway, cool art. Here are these cards here. Let's see. Something like that. Let's see what we got for our little die here. Okay, black and green. Is that a new color combo they're doing? That green looks different. I don't know. Got our box. Nothing crazy. Got our promo card. We'll look at that later. You get six draft boosters. Uh, yeah. We'll see what we can see here. Brand new set. Uh, continuing the story of Phyrexia All Be One. See if we, uh, as much as people are not liking and liking the story, um, it's all about the cards, really. So we'll see what we can pull. Anything crazy cool. A lot of cool, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, a lot of cool things to pull. See if we can get a few. First things first, we have our first battle Invasion of Zendikar. And it flips over into Awakened Skyclave. And our rare is C Double with the, what do they call them? Multiverse Legends? Uh, Firja, Judge of Valor from Cal Time. I'll take that. We do get a foil. Oh, there's a lot of, th what? why is there a land at the back? Anyway, we got a land a token, but we got Zergo and Ojitai as our mythic. Flying Haste and a foil. Can't, can't beat that. Org Dragon. Well, that's <clears throat> not too bad for one pack. Let's see, Disturbing Conversation, we got the Pest, Revelation, Scrounger, Corrupted Conviction, Mirrored and Avenged, Sundered the Gateway, Tangled Skyline, Phyrexian Awakening, Ramosian Greatsword, we got Nezumi Freewheeler, and that flips over into Hideous Flush Wheeler. Looks like there's a flip card before the rare slot then, because there was a flip card in the last time too. We have another Mythic with Invasion of Tarkir. It's a battle. Uh, I'm not going to read all that because it's a lot of text, but I'll flip it over. Defiant Thundermaw. It's a dragon. You know, Tarkir makes sense. Put that right there. We got Rona, Shieldred's Faithful as our multiversal. And a Full Art Swamp, which is dope looking. Next pack. And the set seems pretty cool to draft. Unfortunately, can't get to a pre release today. Because again, I'll pick mine up. But yeah, a lot of cool cards. Really cool seeing all the planes. Again, even if it's just for brief cameos. and Stormclaw Rager. The Crusher. Sun Blessed Guardian. That flips. Furnace Blessed Conqueror. Then we have Invasion. Invasion of Mercadia. Mercadia. And that turns into Chiron Flamerite. We have our rare of Drana and Linvala. Pretty awesome. We got Finn the Fang Bearer in the Multiverse Legends. We have an upside down Pelucranos for some reason. And he turns into Engine of Ruin, which is cool. My thought artwork's sick. And then we have a cool planes as well. Uh right there, I guess. I don't know why he was upside down, but whatever. <clears throat> and the Multiversal Legends are pretty cool. It's like a bunch of uh cards have come out that didn't really have the treatments that we, the uh, newer cards get now. Some of them, there's a few, like the Call Time and the Theros Beyond Death. Some of those are reprints, but a lot of them are new in the new frame. We have the Connoisseur, Inquisitor, Herbology Instructor, and the Mal Malady Invoker. We have Invasion of Vryn, into Overloaded Mage Ring, it's a battle. We have Bloodfeather Phoenix, is our rare, Fire Song and Sunspeaker in the Multiverse Legends. Arachnid Adaptation is our foil, and a Rugged Highlands is our land. Man, they tack a lot of stuff at the end of these packs, don't they? These packs tear open super weird too. They're just like like tissue paper almost. Alright, we got Tidal Terror, Disturbing Conversion, Overgrown Pest, Unsealed and Acropolis, great name. Cargus Death Guard, Sigiled Sentinel, Furtive Analyst, <laughs> uh, Kithkin Billy Rider, Botanical Brawler, 
Furnace Reigns, Blight, good lord, Bright, I can't speak, Blight Reaper Thalid, that flips over into Blight Silver Thalid. We have Invasion of Kaladesh, which flips over into Aether Wing Gold Scale Flagship vehicle. We got our boy Quintorius, Lore Master, in the Lore Hold frame. Yargol, my boy, and an island. Not Lore Hold frame, sorry, the Strixhaven frame. Alright, we are down to our last pack here. See if we can't save the best for the last. Icker Drinker, Searing Barb, Ephara's Dispersal, Assailant, Scroll Shift. Gloomfang Mauler, Vert of Analyst, Streetwise Negotiator, Kami of the Whispered Hope, Bonded Herd Beast, into Plated Kiln Beast. We have Invasion of Asgol, it's a battle. That flips over into Ashen Reaper. Then we have our rare Rangel and Torbran, hanging out, vibing, with Judith, the Scourge Diva, as our multiverse card, and a land. So, yeah, nothing too crazy. Got a Jeskai Commander. Mythic as well as a battle. Let's see what we got for our fancy card here. I don't know if these can be serialized or not. I don't think that they can be. Let's see here. Let's flip it over. And I flipped it upside down. Doomscar Warrior. Uh, not the best. I'm assuming. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. They get the uh, they get the uh, fancy mythic only in the like not playable technically. Slime foot and squee. And then there's a code card for somebody. Well, yeah. That's uh, that's all we got here. Uh, thanks for watching. Probably going to open up some more of this stuff as the weekend unfolds. Until next time, I'll catch you later.